All right, here we go. Okay, what day is it, baby? Hi, my name is Bruce <laughs> Olavresley. <laughs> it's St. Patty's Day, and I'm going to make world-famous car bombs, Irish car bombs. Okay. The kind that you only find in your better drunken establishments. <laughs> We're going to use, oh, listen to that. That's a world famous Guinness beer with its world famous whatever that is. <laughs> Variation theme of GD. Wait, hold on, I have to show the table. Our setup here. And our authentic Irish whiskey over there. Yeah, our authentic redneck whiskey made from the <laughs> finest Tennessee Jim Beam available. <laughs> oh wait, wait, wait. And then this is my this is my little leprechaun because it has a garter around it. All right. Mine's just got the clap. So how do you make the car bomb? So what we're going to do is pour half a cup of Guinness beer, get some world famous shot glasses, and what we're going to do is share half and half with some wonderful Irish Bailey's cream. Oh, I think I'll put that on second. Let's float that on top of the Jim Beam for that <laughs> added appeal. Talk amongst yourselves while we're doing this. Have a shot of some uh, not so Irish whiskey. Half a shot of some Irish Bailey's cream. Oh, look at that. Does it make your mouth water? <laughs> Yummy. And then to make the whole thing, the Irish car bomb, explode into a joyous occasion. Boom! <laughs> Boom! Then, of course, the coup de grace is to chug it, drink it down. <laughs> okay, happy St. Patty's. Go for it. You can, you, it away. you can take it off. Shall we? Mm-hmm. <laughs>